Okay, it's recording. So, <clears throat> so here we go. I'm more impressed so much you thought may have to log in with a <clears throat> password I give you because it wasn't working. I'm going to go to WPN. I'm gonna add a post. So I'm gonna go to Chrome. And in Chrome, I had Instagram open. For sure, I had Instagram open. Oh, probably in Chrome. That's Instagram. Instagram mode. So, let's say I want this. Having a rough day. Let's say I want this. I'm going to click these three dots here. And it's going to say embed. Now, it will, it's only going to say embed if you open up Chrome. If you use the Instagram app, it doesn't embed as a share. So, I'm going to click embed. I'm going to select all. That has to slug it all. Fine, I'm gonna copy the whole thing. So you could probably figure out how to copy this better than I can because it really ain't a pass. Um, I'll try that. So I'm gonna go back to the app. And I want to base this at the source. So you got the whole thing. I'm gonna give it a title. Deleting message. Having a bad day. There, look, it showed up okay. So, the preview is just kind of wonky. It's a lot easier to do this on your computer, but that's pretty much the gist of how to do it now. I'll post a picture too, so I can show you how to do it for Instagram. So 
Somehow you can get this thing to work. You know, if you wanted to just type something, so... Um, let's say, teaching our future. Teaching our future, right? Now, let's say you have a picture, which I'm going to find on Instagram. Go back to Instagram. So let's say I'm going to look at this picture. Let's say, let's say I have this picture. Um, let's say I have that picture on my um, iPad or in my gallery. So I'm just going to take a screenshot of it. 
Okay, so now I'm going to crop it. Yeah, I'm videotaping. So let's say I cropped it, right? And then I'm gonna, um... Go to WordPress. And I wanted to upload it so I can add the picture and upload it from the gallery. Okay. So I actually can upload the picture into the server. I wouldn't recommend doing this too often, but you know, you can. I would I would rather leave the pictures on Flickr or Instagram or both. Um, you can learn about how to do Flickr too, but Flickr can help with SEO. So I'm gonna post it. So there you go. So teaching our future, there's the picture of the day, daily message, so now we can go look at your blog on Chrome. Um... Okay, and we should see the updates. Teaching our future, right there. Quote of the day. Now, the featured image is why this is blank. I'm not sure why those show up. Um, let's see if we could fix one of the featured images. The featured image means it shows up in the post um, header. That's kind of, you know, it's, it's not hard. It's just something that has to do with it. So I'm going to edit this. I'm going to set featured image. I'm going to choose that. And hit back. And hit update. So now, if we go to the blog and hit refresh, there, see, it showed up. So you can set featured images for your post. That way, all these little um, thumbnails they show up. Now, it might pull the featured image. I'm not sure why, it, how it pulled these. Um, I did these online, so, you know, on a computer it might do that stuff automatically. But I noticed the two that we just did today, the quote of the day, for example, it didn't pull the featured image, so we can try and go back and look at that particular post. I'm lost. Oh, post. post. So let's say I want to edit that and choose uh, the gear. Um, set featured image. So, yeah. It's not pulling it. 
like it does on the desktop. So it actually pulls it on the desktop. So everything is just a lot easier on the desktop, but if you want to do stuff, you know, on the phone, you can, or on an app, you can, like I'm doing, so... For now, I'm just going to set the screen featured image just for fun and hit update. So then if I go there to quote of the day, it should yep, filled it in. There you go. So that's how that works. So that is how we do WordPress.